Hey everyone, it's Hadara. Hi. It's time for another seven day scripture challenge. I want to focus on Deuteronomy, Deuteronomy verse six, Deuteronomy chapter six, verse five. It's a passage that we all know and love, but I just want to take one part of it for a moment and focus on the subject of the text. It says, you shall love Yahuwah, your Elohim, with all your heart, with all your being, with all your might. You shall love Yahuwah, your Elohim, with all your heart, with all your being, with all your might. How many times have you given all your heart, your being, and your might to someone other than Yahuwah? Where has that left you? My guess is not in a good place. I've been there before. And the reality is, it's not a beautiful place to be in. But Yahuwah, when we give him our heart, it is beautiful. He says, you shall love Yahuwah, your Elohim, with all your heart, with all your mind, with all your being. When we do this, we learn more about what love really is. Because he pours into us in a way like no one else can. And if we let him, we will experience that real, true love. And maybe then we'll stop searching for it in places where we could never find it. Especially when from the very beginning we can see that we're in the wrong place and we ignore it. And then we go back to that place again, thinking, oh, it's all going to work out. Understand me very clearly. Yahuwah asks us to love him and him alone with all our heart, all our mind, all our being, all our strength. It's for him. And how we balance that out with the rest of humankind? I'm still trying to figure that out. I'm really still trying to figure that out. Anyhow, this channel's for music and motivation for your spiritual journey. So I won't get too deep into my struggles and my pain. But what I will say is that I was just in the studio on Friday recording the next album for you. You guys want to see what happened behind the scenes? You think I should start with the hard one and just get it over with, or the easy ones? With an easy one, yeah? Yeah, then you feel better. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, it's true. That's what I had originally thought, too. Okay, Wahabta. This one is Hebrew, so the, the chorus is Hebrew, so it's going to sound like, you're going to be like, what is she saying? Ooh, uh, you, ooh, U A H A B T A H. <clears throat> it means you shall love. <laughs> Hi everyone, it's Adara. I'm in the recording studio again, making the next album for you. So here we go. <clears throat> Kevin's in the other room recording for me. <clears throat> okay, sorry. <laughs> Looking at the camera.
So that's what's been going on and I can't wait to share more with you but in the meantime especially over the next seven days let's focus on Deuteronomy 6 verse 5 you shall love Yahuwah your Allahim with all your heart with all your mind with all your being with all your heart with all your being and with all your might that's your strength don't give your power to anyone but Yahuwah he's the one who will who will keep you safe. He is the one who will bring you through. He's the one who will pour love right back into you. Never ever forget that. Thank you so much for those of you who will join in on this challenge, the seven day scripture challenge where we take five minutes every morning to focus on the word of Yahuwah and to let his word permeate and direct our lives. I just ask that you would all keep the recording in your prayers. It's taking longer for me to complete this recording than I had planned. And that's all right. Yahuwah does his thing in his time. And I realized that you can't rush a good thing. So um, I had hoped it would be out mid-November, but the reality is I only have three songs recorded. Got that done on Friday in the one session. So I do need to go back again Next date is uh, the 16th, where I'll be in the studio again. And uh, hope we'll see how much I get done then at that point. So I'll keep you guys posted. I'm praying. I'm, my goal is to have it all out before mid-December. Um, but let's see. Let's just take it one day at a time. Okay, keep it in prayer. And I just want to thank you so much for everything that you've done, being a part of this community, being part of the prayers, being ah for your financial gifts, your love gifts that you send to help me go to the studio and record. Thank you so much. So I'll keep you all posted and I will stay connected. Um, just remember, Yah is love and he asks us to love him in return. Deuteronomy 6 verse 5. You shall love Yahuwah your Elohim with all your heart, with all your being, with all your might. Trust him and love him. He loves you. Get more music and motivation for your spiritual journey at setapartheart.com. We will see you again soon. Bye-bye.